despite the names, I totally agree. Uh, the, yeah, you know, it's true. It's true. I in some videos, I um, I, I, I said uh, while I, I'm here talking about uh, single session therapy, I traveled the world to talk about single session therapy. But um, Ira said, uh, if then we will have something better, or if I find something better, I don't care the name, I don't care single session therapy. Uh, what is important is that it, it is effective. Um, yeah. Well, okay, um, I canceled this interview. Well, it's a stop. <laughs> no, I have the last, the last question, which is very important to me and very special for this moment because uh, <clears throat> I do this, this last question uh, in every interview I do. And um, your work inspired me this, 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 uh, this last question. And um, here it is, and now you will find why. Um, suppose that you have to give an advertise, um, a suggestion, sorry, uh, to, um, to a young psychologist. Oh, not so young. Um, and you want to suggest to him or her an exercise that he can practice in during his common life, that is in his days, that can be helpful for him or her in uh, their uh, private practice as psychologists. What could be this, this suggestion? Well, well I, would I would say, say if you, if want, you want to improve, improve you, you need to know what, know what your baseline, baseline performance is. is. Hmm. And the, and the only, only way to do that is to measure and find, and find out. out. So, so if, if there was, was a suggestion about eventually becoming more effective, it would be about figuring out how effective you are right now, so that any adjustments will be able to see does it improve your results. If I don't have any other information about the person and they push me really hard, then I would say, I'm a guy who plays the base rates. There are long shots when you're placing a bet, the horse, the horse that's, that's running, running with, with 100 to 1 odds, odds and, and there, there are more sure bets, bets 2 to 1, one, one, one to 1. And, and I'm, I'm going to bet, bet on, on the factors, factors that contribute the most to treatment outcome. outcome. And, and so, so if, if any therapist, therapist young, young or old, came, came to me and said, said, I don't know what to work on, I would say, since you don't have a baseline, that we can figure out what specifically you need to learn to push your performance to the next level. Then, then I, I think, think improving, improving your ability to respond empathically is probably the best place to invest, to invest your time, not knowing anything about you. Therapists believe that their empathic, empathic abilities improve with time. time. They do not. Therapists believe they're equally empathic to all clients. clients. They, they are not. not. And so, and so I have, I have to find out when, when your, your empathic, empathic abilities, that is, that is the ability to convey to the, to the client that, that I understand and I get you, which, which is in and, in and of itself, itself a healing, healing practice. practice. People who feel, who feel understood, understood, doors open, open to them. I can move on. on. I can, that's, that's probably where I would say to invest, to invest your, your time. time. That's fantastic. Scott, thank you. Uh, it's my pleasure, Flavio. I appreciate the opportunity. Yeah, and um, I'll see you in the next training. That'd be great. Look forward to it. And any of your colleagues, always welcome. Thank you.